A year ago, an Ozark church was broken into and vandalized by teenagers while the church was trying to renovate their property. Now that church is almost done with the renovations, not letting a minor setback get in the way of their overall goal. WDHN's Aaron Dixon has more on the story you'll see only on WDHN. MSA Ozark Church of God by Faith here on Willa Drive has been renovating their church since 2021. And during that time, teenagers vandalized their place of worship and incident church leaders didn't let interfere with their mission of finishing construction and spreading the word of God. A year ago, vandals left scattered church programs, broken glass, disheveled chairs, and turned over flower pots throughout a church that was under renovation, including the fellowship hall where the congregation worshiped. It's, it's hard breaking to have somebody to come in and destroy what you're working on, okay? But we didn't let that stop us because we know where our help come from. Now, 14 months later, the church is nearly finished with renovations. But I tell you, it's exciting to get to the end. You know, when you can see the light at the end of the tunnel, it makes a lot of difference. So uh, initially it was a very small light, but the light's getting larger now and we can see the end. The church has a brand new sanctuary to worship, new classrooms ready for Sunday school, a new library that will be available for kids looking for a place to study, and a fellowship hall, which was once a place where people worshiped, is now being used for its purpose of being a large room to be used for church, social, and community events. A lot of people had doubt that we would even uh, get this for in the project. So we just want to give all the glory to God because because of him, we were, we are, we are today. No arrests were ever made in the vandalism incident. However, the church did recover a speaker that was stolen and the congregation was able to move forward and finish what they started. Well, it made us stronger, no doubt, because with God, all things are possible. So we just kept looking to God to see us through it, despite of what we went through. On Saturday, the church will hold a dedication ceremony for the sanctuary here at 11 in the morning, celebrating all of the hard work put into this space. We're in Ozark, Aaron Dixon, WDHN News for The Wiregrass.